Hey there, guys, and welcome to yet another episode of Blue Sky Beauty. I'm your host, as always, Victoria Fox, and this month, we are delving back into the world of food with the Orange Bird. Introduced in 1970, the Orange Bird was created by Disney for the Florida Citrus Commission and has pretty much been popular ever since. I mean, it's adorable. Come on. Now, uh, you might also be familiar with the Citrus Swirl that is available at the Magic Kingdom and is a delicious ice cream treat, which partially inspired this look as well. Well, um, I'm getting pretty hungry, so let's get started. First, we're starting with the usual foundation, concealer, powder, and brows. Next, we'll start with some Orange Bird Orange for the eyes, or Kat Von D's analog if we're getting technical here. Cover the entirety of your lid and fan it out a bit at the ends with a brush. I'm initially applying the color with my fingertips because that allows me to get a lot of pigment on at one time. Now I'm taking a burnt orange color like Kat Von D's Succubus and applying it heavily in the crease of my eye with a small brush. After you have some definition, add a dark brown like Kat Von D's Surtree to the corners and smoke it out with a fluffy brush. I'm now taking a bright yellow color, Kat Von D's Fran, and applying it to my inner corner and lower lash line. I am also blending it up from the inner corners toward the center of the lid. Add a little bit of gold pigment to the center of the lid if you're feeling fancy. Now we'll apply the beginnings of our leaf eyeliner. Taking a thin brush and white paint, draw along your upper lash line towards the outer edge of the eye, pulling it into a leaf-like shape at the end. This might take a few tries, it certainly did for me. I also put a small amount of the paint on the middle of my lower lash line. The paint I'm using here is Snazaroo. Taking a bright green pigment and another small brush, fill those white paint areas in. Here I'm using Kat Von D's Vinyl.
Next, taking some black eyeliner, color in the details of the leaf on your upper lash line. Here I'm using a Wet n Wild liquid liner. Apply your favorite mascara. For some added flair, I decided to put some white and orange freckles on my cheeks with a small brush. Here I'm using Snazaroo White Paint and the UV Orange Color from the Cryolon Aqua Color UV Palette. Be sure to make these as random and different in location as possible, like actual freckles. Now you'll highlight your face with a golden pigment. Here I'm using IBY Beauty's 24 Karat Magic Highlighter. I added some shine to my cheekbones, nose, cupid's bow, brow bone, chin, and forehead. Be sure to smoke out those eyes as well with this color. Bronzer and blush time. Here I'm using Tarte's Feisty Blush heavily on my cheekbones, apples of my cheeks, and the tip of my nose. I also took MAC's Star Trek Bronzer and Highly Illogical to contour my entire face and punch up that blush when needed. Last but not least, you need an orange lip. For my base, I used Stockholm from NYX Cosmetics, a corally pink matte lip. I then placed the same orange eyeshadow color I used before over top of it and some gold highlighter in the center for some added dimension. Add a flower to your hair and you're ready to go! Well, here is our finished look. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you have any suggestions for any future videos, please leave them in the comments below and I will see you guys next time. Bye!